And leading them out there, their 6'5 quarterback. And this could be a whole lot of fun because if his game plan goes into effect early, we see some shots downfield, aren't we? What did he talk to us about? Stretching the field. Wants to open things up for not just his receivers, but for anything underneath. Well, that was the theme, the front page of the sports section, where the columnists write, possible air raid. So we'll see. Yeah, it's going to be interesting to see how the coaches view that, right? What? Who gave away the game plan? I think it's pretty obvious, though. That'll help them win. A quick throw. Here's Shepard. And he got blown up on that play. Back at the 20. The tally there, minus two yards, brings up third down. And I don't think this is the script they had in mind for their opening drive. This is third and long. Throwing Jones, going up top. Incomplete. Both players were there offensively and defensively. The Bengals will take over here first and 10. So from the 39 now, they'll come up on a first and 10. The former second round pick, this is Joe Mixon. And he is met in his tracks behind the line of scrimmage. They'll wind up losing four yards on the play. And it'll bring up a second and 14. The play action fake, they'll look to throw. That's complete to John Ross. And they bring him to the ground just shy of midfield. That one good for 15, and the Bengals get a first down. And a nice start there to the aerial attack to pick up the first. And I think preseason is officially over now. Getting into the groove of the regular season, that's a great way to get started. First drive of the season, what a nice completion. It's a six-yard pickup, but it gets him to second and four. A quick burst there, and he nicely bit off a pretty decent game. The last run got six, now second and four. Second and four. And nearly an interception here on their opening drive. But instead, third down. He kind of forced that one there, didn't he? It's almost like he predetermined where he was going to go with the football. Yeah, he wasn't really going through progressions. He wanted to go to his top guy. You do that against this defense, they'll make you pay, won't they? Yeah, they certainly will. They react very quickly to the thrown football. Out of the gun now on third down. Hard throw, incomplete. The one with the dive look that time on defense just flooded the field with defensive backs, blanketed everyone, took away all the passing angles, thus the incompletion. Zach Taylor, a new breed of head coach. He's going to go for it on fourth down. Back to throw here. That's caught by his tight end, Uzama. And he's going to get this down near the 30-yard line. They'll get 14 on that one. Good for a bangle first down. Well, peel back the curtain, partner. We've got a pretty good look into how they plan to play this game. Aggressive seems to be the word. Going for it on fourth down in that situation. Yeah, opening drive. Now, we know this coaching staff, they have traits of aggression in their history, but what a start to this game. They're going for it. Yeah, a lot of people might say reckless, but they got it. One for one on fourth down here early in the game. Come on, set. Turn two, stop. Hey, team six. Team six. 50 seconds. 50 seconds. Come on. Let's go. They'll stick with the passing game as he looks to throw. Gets this one to Hill. And he'll take this into the end zone for a Bengal TD. Jones and the Giants now with a first and 10 at their 25-yard line. They'll start out on the ground at Saquon Barkley. They'll be dropped after a gain of about six across the 30 to the 31. Well, it's time for them to be good teammates right here. And what I mean by that is possess the ball for a little while. Get at least two first downs. Give their defense a chance to settle down a little bit after they give up the touchdown. One thing to keep in mind, partner, especially in the second half, when you've got a running back of this size, of these dimensions, I can just tell you, attrition does set in for a defense because you're excited about hitting him in the first half. Maybe not so much in the second half, and some of these shorter gains turn into bigger runs later. They get six on the pick up there as the drive will continue. So from the 39 now, they'll come up on a first and 10. Now Jones. That's complete to Slayton. And this play will be blown up. He'll lose yardage back at the 38. 
It's a loss of a yard there, and it's second down. If you're a selfish player and you're throwing the ball, you're cool with the completion. Maybe not so cool with the yardage loss, though, huh? Yeah, you went, you went backwards on the yardage. Hey, it kind of works like a sack for the defense there. Yeah, it's a really big play for them, right? Able to figure it out, sniff it out, and finish it off. After one, seven nothing on EA Sports. Down, 60 Pittsburgh. To throw on third down, Jones firing quickly here, and that's complete. Ball beat him on that play, did they? No, the, the drag, that guy can be your safety valve. We saw it right there. Yeah, and it picked up a first down for him, too. Looking to throw, Jones. And he's going to be sacked. They sack him back right at the midfield stripe. Carl Lawson with a little how do you do as he gets in there for the sack. Now, following the sack, they'll look to make amends on a second down and 17. From the midfield stripe, they'll look to throw. They'll complete this to Ingram as tight end. And he'll go down shy of the 40 at the 41. The Giants on third down. They've been okay, two for three thus far. This is third and eight. Here's Jones, operating from the gun. Nowhere to escape, and he goes down. Now the Cincinnati offense ready to see what they can do here. They'll be looking to duplicate that first drive, the one that got them that 7-0 lead. Of course they would. I mean, look, they're on the road. So getting the 7-0 lead was huge for them, right? Imagine getting up two touchdowns on the road, taking the crowd out of the game. It'd be ideal. Tackle made there by Jabril Peppers. They'll come up second and six now from the 24. Kill, kill. Now Joe Mixon. And this time not as successful as he'll get back to the line of scrimmage and no more. No gain on the play there, so they're left with a third down and six. They'll look to throw here. He finds his running back, Mixon. And they'll get it up just short of the 45 at the 44. Give him 19 there as the drive marches forward. And we see another pitch and catch there to the running back. This position just continues to evolve. They become just as critical to the passing attack as a lot of receivers tight ends because their ability to make people miss in the open field can really generate big plays for an offense. Just a yard on the first down carry, so it's second and nine. Here's second and nine, just a yard on that last run. Two minutes on the clock, second quarter, seven nothing ball game. We remind you that coming up in two minutes, we'll again head down to visit with Jonathan Coachman in Orlando back for another year. He'll have scores from around the NFL here on this opening weekend. Second and nine now. Going left side here, and it's complete. And they're going to have another first down as the tackle's made at the Giants' 39. So from the 39 now, they'll come up on a first and 10. Now back to throw. He's got a man, and that's Alex Erickson. And he's going to get this one down to the edge of the red zone. Now after the completion, we're going to get a timeout, an injured player. Huh, hate to see this. Week one of the season. We'll be back. Inside the red zone here, they'll look to throw. They complete it to Hill. And he'll be taken down at the two-yard line. 17 more yards on that one as they keep the drive rolling. Two big plays in succession. Not sure this D knows what hit them, but now they got to get ready. It's first and goal. Again, he'll drop to throw. To the goal line, but it's incomplete. And as a first-rounder, a lot of eyes on him, a lot of expectations. And he has to play well in his rookie year. Those days of coddling guys and bringing them along slowly, those days are long gone. When you're drafted in the first round, they expect you to play right away. And the community's eyes and fan base, they'll be on you the entire way. And you take a look at this draft class from a seat. That's going to be caught by Ross for a Bengal touchdown. 
The Bengal offense now with a football first here to begin quarter number three. They built a good first half lead. Now they have a chance to add on to it. And what I'm thinking is that the offensive staff spent the entire halftime just working with them on, here's what we think they're going to do to attack us in the second half. Nice first half that we've had, guys, but be prepared for some change-ups. We're going to see them when we kick it off in the second half. See how they handle any adjustments that might be made defensively. Again, it's Mixon. And he'll be brought down shy of the 40 at the 38-yard line. They'll get three as the drive continues. It's a first down. So here's a first and 10 at the 38. They'll run with Mixon. Solid move, but he's corralled just beyond the 40. A gain of three, second down. Three yards on that last carry. Here's second and seven. Here's a second and seven. Wide open receiver complete. And all the way in for a Cincinnati score. A big play there with his first career touchdown. Here's the Giants offense now getting set to start the third quarter. And their halftime hole now even deeper, and they need a big drive here just to answer the first touchdown of the second half scored against them. They were down at the half. Now, as you mentioned, they're down a little bit bigger, but no time for discouragement. Just gotta get back to it, right? Put your shoulder against the boulder and start pushing and try and get back to where you were to start the half. And partner, I think that was a great example that not all tight ends are created equal because everything was right. Got the completion, but he's not one of the more dynamic guys in the league. So even though he caught it, couldn't turn it into much more. Now Saquon Barkley, and they're going to get him behind the line yet again as his nightmare afternoon continues. A gain of three last play. This time they double it and pick up six. This offense in desperate need of a conversion as they come up on third down. Again, it's Barkley. And he's going to have the first down yardage to the 35. He needed a yard. That's what he got. And it's going to earn him a new set of downs. Tough first half for him. Unable to put up the numbers he's used to producing. But with a guy like him, you and I both know it just takes a couple of explosive touches for him to make an impact on this game and on the stat sheet as well. Jones throw on target to Shepard. Ten yards on the pickup there, and it'll be second down. They sure put the coverage guys in a stress on that one. They thought they were going deep. Ends up curling inside for a nice chunk of yardage. So second in inches after that first down completion went just shy of the marker. It's hauled in by Shepard. A gain of just a yard, but it's a first down. Couple of first downs to kick off the drive. Here's first and 10 up at the 46. They go back to the ground now with Barkley. And he'll be brought down somewhat awkwardly here and a late flag as well. I think this one's going to be a face mask. So that flag will cost him 15. And it doesn't matter anymore how you get the face mask. Any part of it is going to be 15 yards. After the penalty, they go with Barkley. And he's going to get this inside the 30. First down for the Giants as they pick up 12. First downs have not come easy, and neither have runs like this throughout this game. Absolutely not. He finally felt like, whoa, a sigh of relief. We got something going in the running game. All that, and it only nets him a yard. It's second down. The goal of a wide receiver screen is get enough blockers in front to create a wall and let him pick his spot to run the football. How about the defense there swarming to it and not allowing them? Under pressure, and he'll go down. Sacked back at the 31. Carlos Dunlap, the Florida Gator, chopping his way to the quarterback. They missed a field goal on their last drive. Here they need something to even get into field goal range on third down. A short throw to Ingram. And he'll go down at the 28. They stop him for only three that time, and that'll bring up fourth down. We are through three quarters here on NFL Kickoff Weekend. We'll return with more after this. This is the NFL, and it's on EA Sports. A critical one here if they're going to have any shot at this thing. So they'll go for it on fourth down. 
Got a man, Slayton. And he gets it inside the 10 to the 9. Some collective exhales over there on the sideline. A big pickup through the air on fourth down to bring up first and goal. Let's go, heavy. Let's go, heavy. Heavy, what you got? They'll try and run for it with Barkley. And from the nine, they get this to the five-yard line. What a game this defense continues to play, huh? Yeah, they've been aggressive from the first snap, and they've controlled this ball game. But right now, if you're on the other side of the ball, you've got to match that aggressiveness. Nope. And he's got it. Touchdown, Giants. Darius Slayton. They're ready now, ready to take the field. Well, there are two scores on the plus side. Still time here this fourth quarter, but maybe you start thinking about playing keep away. Yeah, I think here's the situation. You're not thinking touchdowns anymore. You're just thinking first downs to keep up with your theme there, playing keep away. First downs, they can't touch the ball. Nine yards is the pick up there, and they'll have a second and one. Something to watch here in week one of the season, tackling. Because you and I both know that in the preseason, a lot of these guys don't play a whole lot. Plus, the intensity and the speed really ratchets up on opening week. And taking it across midfield and inside the 45. Give them 17 and a Cincinnati first down. I tell you, they didn't give it to him much for the first three quarters, but when they have, he's been efficient. Maybe they ride him more here down the stretch. Hey, I'm not sure it was actually in the game plan for him to have as few carries as he has, but it might play out really well for them now. As you noted, if they want to ride him down the stretch, he should have fresh legs. 12 yards that time and a Cincinnati first down. From the 32 now, here's first and 10. He'll look to throw. And incomplete, he dropped it. Maybe a rookie mistake there, second down. Timing's crucial in any route thrown, but when you throw an out, so many things are going through the mind of the receiver. Catching the ball, timing it up with the quarterback. Are my feet going to get down inbounds? On that play, all those things going through his head might have caused him to drop it. After getting stuffed on first down, not much better there, two yard gain. Back to throw. Oh, incomplete. Nearly the pick they needed. Away. Miracles can happen. And you want to be here in case it does. You're a company man. Aren't I, though? Jones and the Giants now with a first and 10 at their own 25 yard line. On oh, the run, it's Barkley. And that didn't fool anybody. He's going to be dropped in the backfield. A loss of two there, second down. Continues to be a struggle for this offense and this home crowd. They're growing a little restless here in the second half. And I think they've just got to look at how they're trying to move the football. Yeah, you want to run it, but maybe you spread it out, maybe some swing passes that can take the place of runs and give you a little more space. Two minutes left to play in this football game here on EA Sports. So it's Giants football here as we welcome you back. They face a third down now as they try to find a late score. Back to throw. Jones. And Ingram holds it in. And he's got the first down yardage before he's brought down at the 42. Looking to throw. Jones. Over the middle, he's got his tight end, Ingram. And he'll go down right around the 47 this time. Looking to throw again on second down. Jones will get this out to Barkley complete. It's a loss of four. Now third down. Well, that last completion certainly not what they were hoping for is now they'll try to convert on third. Jones now operating from the gun. And he can't quite pick it. No interception so far. That probably should have been their first. But at least it's fourth down. All right, they're going to try and keep hope alive here on fourth down. They're going for it. Now Jones throwing on fourth down. And this is going to be incomplete. They had to go for it with such little time remaining. So for Cincinnati, not much to complain about here. They come in and steal a victory in a tough place to play on a Sunday night. And they will head back home next week. Meanwhile, for the Giants, they go down to defeat here in the opener. And they'll try to rebound next week on the road in Washington.
So for Charles Davis and our entire crew, I'm Brandon God. Next game, guess what? Charles and I will be here again. It's the NFL on EA Sports.